beautiful viewers, my clients, my friends, family, everybody who's here. I want to wish you a very happy new year and the best is yet to come. I believe this is going to be a really good year. And enjoy these few last days of this year the best you can. Bring that energy into the next year. So make your affirmations, enjoy yourself, be happy, think positive, and bring it all into the next year. I wanted to also announce that um, my express readings for coffee cups and, um, well, all my readings that I do, the express um, readings, I'm going to be closing them as of today till I get back because I'm going up, up town. Um, my first little vacation getaway, very well deserved, believe me, I've been working like a dog. So I will be out of town, so I'm, I'm not going to be doing any readings from tonight, and the, especially the express readings. So they will resume after the first, probably the third. Anyway, um, like I said, I wish you all a happy, happy, happy new year. Bring in that joy, bring in that positivity, and the best is yet to come. Hello, Bye, guys. guys. And welcome to your Coffee Cup reading for the week ahead of January 2nd. And these energies can start anytime now and go into the next week. Okay. So basically what we're seeing here is standing your ground, a diversity of opinions, setting your ways in some things and others may see it as you being inflexible or even arrogant. Some others may be wanting you to see things their way, but you have some set standards. Again, we're seeing here opinions and you can listen to advice and you can still do what you want or what you think is right but most of you will have no, a non-negotiable stand on some issues. Okay, so there is popularity here. You're in the spotlight. And there is some luck on your side here. So that looks good. Okay, there is some confusion maybe about a person or a situation. And it's really saying do some research to find out more about, about them or the situation. And don't make any decisions until, until all the facts look clear. There could be some missing pieces to the puzzle. But you will find the missing piece. It'll just come to you. It's just saying just hold off making any decisions till you know you are sure of the facts. That's what's showing up here. That could be about a person, a situation. It's a general reading. Okay, well, some of you, watch your temper. Use your Leo charm instead. You know, you don't like being told what to do or others' opinions. So, you know, just say, hey, thanks, and just do what you, you do. 
because there could be some that maybe, you know, are just being helpful or trying to be helpful, not knowing they can be or come across as, you know, telling you what to do, if you know what I mean. And it's also showing me that some of you are on the right path. Some of you needed to hear that. Okay, let's see the plate. Okay, well, you have like a yes answer, okay? So whatever I didn't mention here or whatever it is that um, it's most likely a yes. It's also saying communicate. Communicating nicely is like golden this week. So watch how you communicate. Kind of went through that in the cup. And some of you are really working on yourselves here. That's good. And some of it could be to improve business or something like that. It's something that's very important to you. You are in the spotlight. Happiness. Very shiny energy. I like that. But also don't mess up the good energy around you also. So use it to your best and most positive ways. So it's looking good here. Well, anyway, Leo, that was your reading for the week ahead of January 2nd. And like I said, I'm going out of town, spending New Year's Eve out, so I won't be able to do express readings. Um, I want you guys to take this great energy you have. Think of what you want next year. Start living it this way these few last days of the year and run with it into 2017. I hope you have a happy, happy, happy new year and a wonderful week and catch you back here next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, bye guys.